Hey guys, what's up? Blaine Cooper here. Sometimes the words I told you so just don't cut it, does it? California seizes guns from owners and it might become a national model. And this is from RT. This is very credible. In California, the government is already coming for the guns. Notwithstanding the Second Amendment, rules and regulations across the United States outline certain restrictions for who can legally possess a firearm. In the state of California, factors such as a felony conviction or a history of mental health issues mean roughly 20,000 gun owners are holding onto their firearms illegally, slowly but surely, through Golden State police officers are prying them away. There's more though. Backers of the program suggest this becomes a nationwide practice and are asking the White House to help make it happen. Here you go guys, in a nutshell. I, we told you this was going to happen. This is how it's going to start. And they're going to make more laws and more laws. They'll make more laws legally, and police officers will enforce them. And they'll make it impossible for you to own a firearm. This is what shall not be infringed was warning us all about. It shall not be infringed no matter what. So now they're coming after the guns. I believe even felons, if they can prove that they're not a nutcase, have the right to protect their family if, and should ha be able to have a firearm. Just because you've had a felony conviction doesn't mean that you're, you're, um, there's a lot of felons out there who are pretty decent people, you guys. So, but I, but, um, but I understand the argument with mental health and felony convictions, but some people's lives have changed. But aside from that, this is setting a bad precedent, you guys, because where does it stop? When does this stop becoming? Look, I mean, look at this. Unbelievable. I don't even know what to say. You guys have a good day. Share this video. Warn people they are coming for the guns. If you guys do not fight, if you guys do not drop these people when they come to your yard, this will never stop. Some people, people need to stand up and unite together and put a stop to this.